Good day everyone, welcome to my channel. So in this video, we will talk about how to become a PHP developer. Before we start, I would like to say thank you so much to all my viewers, silent viewers, and supporters in my channel. Thank you for watching my videos. If you are new with my channel and then you like this video, please hit the like button. Don't forget to share and please support my channel guys by clicking the subscribe button. So let's begin. Becoming a PHP developer involves a combination of learning, practice, and hands-on experience. There are a step-by-step -step guide to help you become a PHP developer. Number one, learn the basics of programming. If, if you're new to programming, start by learning the fundamentals of programming logic, data types, variables, control structures like loops and conditionals, functions, and object-oriented programming or OOP concepts. There are various online resources and tutorials available to help you with this. Number two, understand HTML and CSS. <coughs> Since PHP is often used in web development, having a solid understanding of HTML for structuring content and CSS for styling is essential. These are the building blocks of web development. Number 3. Study PHP. Start learning PHP by doing through tutorials, online courses, and documentation. There are many resources available including the official PHP manual and online platforms like Code Academy, Udemy, Coursera, and other that offer PHP courses. Number four, practice. Practice coding regularly. Start with simple exercises and gradually move on to more complex projects. This will help you reinforce your learning and gain practical experience. Number five, build projects. Start building small projects that involve dynamic web content. Create website, basic websites or user registration systems, simple e-commerce sites, etc. These projects will help you apply your knowledge and build a portfolio. Number six, build a uh, learn databases. Databases are crucial part of most web applications. Learn how to work with databases using structured query language or SQL. SQL is a popular choice for PHP developers. Number seven, explore Frameworks. Familiarize yourself with PHP frameworks like Laravel, Symfony, or CodeIgniter. Frameworks provide a structured way to build web applications, making development more efficient and maintainable. Number 8. Version Control. Learn how to use version control systems like GET. Version control is essential for collaboration in managing code changes. Number 9. Learn about security. Security is crucial in web development. Learn about common security vulnerabilities and best practices for securing your PHP applications. Number 10. Stay updated. PHP involves in new features and practices are introduced. Stay updated with the latest PHP versions in new developments in the PHP ecosystem. Number 11. Build a portfolio. As you gain more experience, build a portfolio showcasing your projects. This can be a personal website or a GitHub repository that potential employers or clients can review. Number 12. Networking. Join developer forums, online communities, and social media groups to connect with other PHP developers. Networking can help you learn, share knowledge, and even find a job opportunities. Number 13. Apply for jobs or freelance. Once you feel confident in your skills, start applying for entry-level PHP developer positions or freelance opportunities. Your portfolio will be an important asset during this stage. 14. Continuously improve. Technology is always changing. Continue to learn and improve your skills by staying curious, exploring new tools, libraries, and practices. Remember, becoming a proficient PHP developer takes time and dedication. It's a journey of continuous learning and growth. Good luck. Okay, guys. So, this is the end of my report on how to become a PHP developer. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you have learned something new in this video. Don't forget to like, share, and please support my channel, guys, if you are new by clicking the subscribe button. See you in the next video tutorial, guys. This is your friend Jake saying bye-bye for now.